Today we will be reviewing shapes. We are focusing on 2D shapes. We are going to look at their sides and their vertices. A side is the line that connects two points of a shape. So in this triangle, we have three sides. One, two, three. So this triangle has three sides. Vertices in shapes are the points where two or more lines meet, like a corner. So here we call this a vertex. Here's one vertex. Here's two vertex. Here's another vertex. A triangle has three vertices. Now we will review shape names. I will show you a shape. You will look at the different sides and the different vertices and tell me the name of the shape. What is the shape's name? Look at the sides, look at the vertices. This shape is a square. A square has four sides, one, two, three, four, and four vertices, one, two, three, four. Now remember, the sides are all the same length. So if you measured the sides, they would all be the same length. Now items in our world that look like a square are a TV, a computer, or even SpongeBob SquarePants. What is the shape's name? Look at the sides, look at the vertices. If you said a triangle, you are correct. This triangle has one, two, three sides and one, two, three vertices. Things that look like this in our uh, world is a slice of pizza right here, a tree top, or a roof of a house in a drawing. What is the shape's name? Look at the sides, look at the vertices. Does it have any sides or any vertices? This is a circle. A circle has curved lines. So it has zero sides, zero vertices. Things in our environment or our world that look like a circle are or have a shape of a circle is a clock, a ball, or a sun. What is the shape's name? Now I want you to look at this shape. Look at the sides, look at the vertices, look at the lengths of the sides. This is a rectangle. A rectangle has four sides. It has two short sides and two long sides. It has four vertices. One, two, three, Four, some things in our world that look like a rectangle or a shape like a rectangle are a door, flag, or the top of a table. What is the shape's name? Now look at the sides. Think about how many sides it has. Think about how many vertices it has. One, vertex, two vertex, three, four vertex, four sides, one, two, three sides, four sides. Look at the way the sides are. Are they straight lines? The name of this is a rhombus. It has four sides. Remember, the rhombus is like the square. The rhombus has all the same length sides. So if you measured all these sides, they are all the same length, just like the square. It also has one, two, three, four vertices. And things that look like that in our world is a kite. What is the shape's name? This is 
an ellipse. An ellipse has zero sides, zero vertices. And it looks like in our environment, things that are shaped like this is a watermelon, egg, or the top of a pool. Sometimes a pool has an ellipse shape. What is the shape's name? Now think about the sides. Think about how many vertices it has. And think about the lengths of the sides. What is the name of this shape? Call it out. A trapezoid. A trapezoid has four sides, four vertices, and it looks like a lamp can have a top that has a trapezoid shape. A popcorn box can have a side that looks like a trapezoid shape. See how it's dotted in blue right here? And sometimes a purse. The outside of a purse can look kind of a trapezoid. It has one, two, three, four vertices and one, two, three, four lines, sides. What is the shape's name? Think about the sides. Count how many sides right now. One, two, three, four, five, six and six vertices. One, two, three, four, five, six vertices. The shape is called a hexagon. A hexagon has six sides that are all the same length. If you measured these sides, you would notice that they're all the same length and six vertices. It looks like sometimes you'll see a beehive that looks like a hexagon. We are now done with our shapes. Please review each day to help you memorize our shapes, how many sides they have, how many vertices they have, and things in our environment that have these shapes. Enjoy.